What's up everyone, this is Scratch, and I've got a quick video here for you to show you the differences in notifications in the new Xbox experience. As you can see, they are squared. You just saw somebody pop online, and now you're seeing that I have uh, inside my radio is ready to, is ready to play, because I was installing it while I was recording this. Um, but you can also see that the distinction uh, between achievements and messages are now that the achievements stayed with the rounded format versus the square, which I prefer because it seems like somebody's always hopping online when I'm going for an achievement. Now I can tell right away whether it's squared or round. Um, Xbox does that a lot. But anyways, uh, something new that you can see here is actually that when someone shares your activity or likes it or comments on it, you get a notification for that now, as well as notifications for when someone uh, adds you as a friend, which I think is really, really cool. Um, so if you're playing with somebody or whatever, you can... It's, a, it's nice to get a link right to their profile and everything. So the only drawback I found so far is that if you if you have something that kind of goes, you know, semi-viral, they can get a little bit distracting. But the cool thing about that is is you do have the option to turn them off. So if you, if you have a, a problem with it or don't like them, you don't have to have them. I personally prefer them. So I'll probably end up leaving mine on unless I'm like super serious concentration or something. But... Um, if you guys have any questions or comments, please leave one below, or you can also uh, find me on Xbox Live Gamertag, aka Space Scratch, and I'll answer any questions or, or whatever you guys might have. And I really appreciate you guys checking this out, and I will catch you all in the next video.